The Minister of Works and Transport, Rohan Sinanan, is inviting Transparency International to visit his ministry. This as he assured that the tendering of contracts under his ministry was being done above board. Are there any queries about any project? Um, <coughs> you know, we should welcome Transparency International because these things, there's the, the, this whole talk about corruption and what we don't understand, the corruption index is, a, is how people perceive you. It doesn't have to be a reality. But if Transparency International could come and look at the, the process and say, no, this process is fair and is above board and everything, that will help us. The invitation came after the body declined to visit NIDCO. Transparency International on September 30th said there have been concerns about contracts being given out by NIDCO, which fall under the Ministry of Works and Transport. Because of this, NIDCO invited Transparency International to visit them and get a first-hand understanding of how they operate. But that invitation was declined. I pointed that they did not take up the, the offer to go in and look at the process. Who knows, they might have made certain recommendation that we would have definitely considered. The thing about it is that there are a lot of people who would speak on topics um, without having all the information. I have heard a former minister who's come out and say the process at NITCO is very vigorous. My experience with them is that they do everything that, that they can do to ensure that the process is transparent and fair.